My name is Ryan Krantz, and this is the Stable of Leadership. And today we're going to talk about the four C's of leadership. And this really uses discussion points from a couple great leaders uh, who have recently written books uh, over the past few years. Uh, one, uh, General Martin Dempsey, uh, the former chairman of the Joint Chief of Staff, who co-authored a book with Ori Brofman last year, Radical Inclusion, and L. David Marquet, who wrote the book Turn the Ship Around about five years ago about his experiences as a submarine captain uh, in the Pacific Fleet. And from those, those two great leaders, uh, we, we talk about uh, the four C's, competence, clarity, context, and character. General Dempsey talks about leaders having a responsibility of being sense makers uh, to their subordinates, making sense of the tasks and the context in which they conduct those tasks. L. David Marquet talks about a responsibility of giving to your subordinates competency and giving them opportunities to get good at their battle tasks, whatever their tasks may be for that particular organization, and then clarity, what General Perkins used to call the affordance of an organization, or why it is we do what we do. To provide context of both what we're doing and why we're doing it, sometimes that involves geopolitical uh, considerations, regional considerations, where it is we're going to conduct those tasks, really is the making sense that General Dempsey's talking about. And lastly, character. Leaders have to lead, lead with character, their authentic self, being honest, being open uh, to their subordinates about what their concerns are uh, in conducting some of those tasks and where they're conducting those tasks. The question for discussion this week is, how do we use the four C's of leadership, competency, clarity, context, and character within our own organizations. I look forward to the discussion.